You know that autumn has well and truly set in as the evenings are a little bit colder and the mornings are quite icy. And at this time of year, the biggest challenges are the higher rainfall and frost, especially if you're in the southern parts of the country. And we can now prepare for these environmental changes by protecting our plants and helping them through the season. One of the first steps in preparation for this seasonal change is as simple as reducing the amount of water. Root and collar rot, along with wet wilt, tend to happen at this time of year because of accidental additional watering. So, keeping an eye on the weather forecast is a good start to combating this problem. And there is the perfect garden gadget for this. Having a weather station in your garden can be really useful as it can help provide you with the most accurate environmental data for your localised area. And if you enjoy growing unique plants that might be a bit sensitive, you will know right away when to move them or to protect them from the elements. This is the new Holman Helios Wi-Fi weather station and over the years I've had them in my garden to help me better understand my local climate and they're really easy to use. There are 16 unique weather data points which gathers the local environmental information live. So you can look at the temperature, wind speed or chill, UV index, dew point, weather forecast and more which can be viewed anywhere at any time on the weather console or the Holman Home app. And looking at this monitor today, we have heavier cloud coverage, which means water evaporation is less likely. And it looks like there might be some rain and high winds in the forecast as well. To prepare for a potential frost, there's a few things you can do. And one of them is to look at the nighttime temperature. And secondly, if there's going to be any clouds in the sky. If it is a cloudy night, it means the atmosphere is warmer. So there's less likely of a chance of frost occurring. Whereas if there's clear skies and the temperature is below about three degrees, you might have a frosty morning. Placing sheets or shade cloth over your plants the night prior will help create a barrier from the frost settling on the foliage. But if your plants do end up with a bit of frost, make sure to hose them down with tap water before the sun hits their leaves. This way the ice will melt away with minimal to no frost burn. Even though it feels like the garden is slowing down, there's still a lot of jobs that can be done. And having a weather station is really useful as it gives you instant information that can help you to better care for your plants even going into the cooler months.